Hey guys! So today I'm going to talk to you about my life binder. I showed this to you very briefly in my room tour and um, quite many of you seemed very interested to see more about what it is. So first let me explain to you what a life binder is. Now a life binder is also known as a home management binder or well, it goes by many names. Um, I call mine a life, mi life binder because I don't really have a whole family, you know, to home manage. Pretty much it's just a binder, pretty obvious, where you uh, keep track of everything and that's important in your life and needs to be kept track of. Pretty much it's an organizer for your life and your activities. Many people, for example, keep track of uh, quarterly and annual cleaning tasks. Many people do budgeting in their uh, home management binders. Meal planning is something many people do in their life binders. Um, I do meal planning as well. What works for me may not work for you and you really need to kind of organize your own life binder. You know, no two are the same. Let me just show you mine so you kind of get a better idea of what I'm talking about. This is my life binder. I thought it was really cute um, and fitting for a life binder. It's by Blonde Amsterdam, it's a Dutch brand. Um, so yeah, I have these tab dividers. And then I have clear files of file folders that are taller than the tabs, so it doesn't really make sense. But anyway, it looks cute. First page I have... Oh, by the way, I got all these printables off of um, like organizing blogs and stuff like that. So first page I have is a peek at the week. This one is from iheartorganizing.com. And it is pretty much like just an agenda. Like here on top I have the week and then what's going on that week. Um, for example, today is Saturday, I have to film a video. Uh, tomorrow I have a barbecue party. You can see what I need to do. I have what week it is, I have that written there. Then this is my to-do list. Um, it's really short right now because obviously I'm on vacation. So I don't need to do as much. I have... Um, I really love this page because it has so much. Pretty much has everything in one page. It has a to-buy list. Um, it have, even has a tiny meal planning list right here, but I don't use it because I have a big one later on. And then um, this just just for random thoughts. I usually write some kind of quote down there or something completely random <laughs> like I have right now. So next page is my meal planning. Um, I got this one. This principle is of. I'm sorry, I, it's not written anywhere, so I have no idea where I got this from. Um, I'm pretty sure you will find it if you google weekly mail planner. Uh, this is what it looks like and this is from a few weeks ago um, when I last planned my meals because I was home for almost the entire week. Um, it has for every day, sorry it's right here, every day what you want to eat as breakfast and then lunch and dinner and here is a shopping list where you can write everything down once you've decided what you're going to eat every day so you only have to go on one shopping trip instead of going back every time you forget something. On the next page I have um, four post-it notes um, that are for four different stores and whenever I remember that I need something from a certain store I will write it on that post-it so that when I eventually go to the store I can just peel off this post-it and um, take it to the store with me and I have like a complete shopping list with me. And this is a kitchen measurement cheat sheet. Then the next page I have these random coffee recipes that came with my uh, flavored syrups. And then I have another tab and these are um, dates to remember. Oh sorry, the cheat sheet was from one good thing by Jilly.com. Now these I have dates to remember. So it just has every month and then like birthdays and anniversaries and that's just really nice for me to keep track of um, birthdays because I tend to forget stuff like that. It's my holiday planning. Now, as again, I live alone, I don't really have to plan anything for the holidays, so this is a very small tab for me, but it's nice, you know, just to keep as an idea for maybe some of you guys. I have this holiday gift tracking thingy, which is really nice. It has one uh, tab for the recipient, the gift, where to purchase it, the budget for it, what it actually costs, whether it's wrapped and whether it's mailed, which is 
just the greatest thing ever. The ones from iHeart Organizing as well. I don't know where the dates to remember from are because the blog isn't on the principle. So on the back of my holiday gift tracking, I actually have some gift ideas written down. Um, just I am one of those people that can never find gifts for others. I'm just bad with gifts. So whenever I come across like a good idea on Pinterest or something for something you can make, um, I just write it down. Yeah, one of my last tabs, I have um, video ideas. You cannot look at this. <laughs> and then I check them off when I've done the video. And then, yeah, next one is my Dungeons and Dragons character sheet. Busted. Okay, um, <laughs> I just keep this in there because I use it a lot, obviously. And then, last tab, I actually plan to make this a separate binder, but I haven't done it yet. So I have recipe clippings from magazines. Um, yeah. So that is all that is in my life binder right now. I do not do my budgeting in this, because I do that digitally, but um, there are awesome principles, budgeting principles out there, so if you want to, you can definitely add some in. So, um, I hope you kind of get what the point is of a life binder now. It is, for me, it really helps me to kind of remain calm in stressful situations, because my head tends to get really crowded and then I kind of panic because there's so much I need to remember and do and just... It is so much nicer to have everything planned out. It is definitely not a necessary thing to have, but it is really nice and it has really helped me um, to tone down my stress levels so much. So that is my life finder. If you have any more questions, please feel free to comment below or send me a message. Um, yeah, I want to thank you so much for watching and I will see you very soon. Bye!